Hey, what's up, guys? Um, here we are, back in the this, <laughs> this little room I call my little personal museum over here. Um, what's it called? I just wanted to show you guys some uh, some things that I picked up off camera. And um, what's it called? It's been a few things. And I have a couple of boxes that I'm going to unbox also that I have I have one uh, via trade um, from Brad Campbell. Uh, remember, I think it was, I don't know if it was like the, the last hunt or the hunt before that one where I mentioned it. But um, uh, definitely been waiting to open this guy up, but I wanted to do it on you know here. I wanted to re I wanted to record it. <laughs> um, all right, guys. So this this hunt you guys should see before the the Vegas hunt, which um, I hope you guys enjoy. I mean, I didn't capture as much as I wanted to, but um, you know, it, it it was such it was such a fun weekend that you know I didn't want to spend most of it just you know recording the whole time. <laughs> uh, but hopefully you guys enjoy. It was definitely fun. It was it was a blast. Um, you know, it's always, it's been tradition. We've been going, um, you know, for the last two, three, four years, well, two, three, like, which one is it, two, three, or four, it was like, last, last three, four years, we've been going over there around the same time, so it's pretty fun, um, but let me, um, let me get to it, guys, um, let me show you guys some things that I picked up off camera as I'm looking around here, uh, first of all, I guess I'll show you guys this one first, a uh, guy I picked up was, um, it was Lightning McQueen, the tar uh, only at Target exclusive. And um, this guy, I wasn't gonna pick him up, but then um, that that's that mace window that I found at Walgreens, um, I ended up trading it for this uh, with another fellow collector here locally, Hans. Um, awesome guy, man. He's always coming through. So, and once I put my eyes on this guy, I was like, wow. I'm like, I'm glad I said yeah, cause I almost said no to him. But I'm super happy that I got to say um, that, that 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 he picked it up for me, and you know we were we were able to trade. Um, so that was awesome, and this thing looked freaking amazing. It's just it's pretty cool it's, this is a cool pop <laughs> this is a pretty cool pop if you uh like cars and i'm talking not i'm not only talking about the movie i'm talking about cars in general um you would like definitely like this pop even if you don't collect pops this thing is a uh, pretty bitchin so i picked up this guy via trade and um what else did i pick up let me see that all right i'm looking like i don't <laughs> have a whole bunch to show you guys um uh, one thing that i picked up um, let me just show you guys real quick a quick backstory. Um, the Maleficent, I I picked. You guys will see. Um, I I I I picked her up in um uh, in Vegas. Spoiler alert. <laughs> but the reason the reason I I said it is because I had already bought her before. Um, my my Vegas trip, I had already had purchased her, and um, I struck out with the chase. And let me tell you guys real quick how I struck out. <laughs> um, they came out on a Tuesday out here locally to me. Um, was it this Tuesday? I think it was this Tuesday she came out. And, um, you know, I knew because one of our one of our local malls, uh, Northridge Mall, had posted her, you know, saying they got them. So I was like, cool, man. Like, I try to I try to go. My girl ended up asking her co-worker to see if she can go with her and pick it up. And by the time she got there, it, they were all out. So they just had the Hot Topic exclusive. exclusive. <laughs> Which I was cool with, because I was totally digging the exclusive. Like, I was digging that pop, like, regardless, chase or no chase. Of course, we always want the chase, but it is what it is. You know, like I said, we can't let a little sticker or a, plas uh, a, a little uh, piece of vinyl, you know, control lives like that. Even though it did take me a couple of hours, but let me get to it. Um, so, that she comes out on, uh, see that she comes out in Northridge, whatever. My um, lady had not gone to work that day, so she's all like, you want me to stop by and have lunch? I was like, yeah, cool, man. I never get that opportunity to have lunch with my lady. <laughs> so we took off, and I told her, you know what? Let's just stop by the Burbank Mall real quick and see if they have her. We go there, and um, there's like three or four people already waiting. And I was like, oh, man. Like, that's I asked him, one of the employees, like, how many do you guys normally get? She's like, two or three, but you never know, you know? So um, she's like, you should go try to some, you guys should try to go, you should, you should try to go elsewhere. Her, there's no line over there. And I was like, nah, man. There's no way I can make it to Hollywood. I'm on my lunch break, lady. <laughs> Oh, that's where she had recommended for me to go to Hollywood. And I was like, no way. And then my girl was like, well, we can wait and let's just wait. Because we've seen the UPS truck. And I was like, yeah, right. Like four people like waiting in line. There's no way. Like not, not even everybody here is going to get a chase, I bet. So me, whatever. We leave. Um, we try to eat in the food court area just in case. And it was like completely remodeled. So I don't think they had a food court. So we're like, yeah, let's go to Pro Loco. But when we went to Pro Loco... And she's like, you sure you don't want to go back? And I was like, no, no, I'm good. Uh, just take me to work. It was fun enough that you come in over, over here to have uh, <laughs> lunch with me. I get to work, and guess what do I see? I see that they posted that they still have a few. They had a few chases left. And I was like, how is that possible? There was like four or five people waiting out there. 
And sure enough, it was, they got nine freaking chases. Like, can you guys believe that? Nine chases. So if I would have waited there, I would probably come out come out with one for sure, maybe even two. Like, I don't know. Like, it 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 would have been like really really awesome, but it wasn't meant to be. And that's how I'm gonna look at it. At least not now. <laughs> All right, guys. But I did pick. I, I you guys as you guys will see, I did pick her up at the at Vegas and Hot Topic. I picked up another one. Um, that's where I was getting to. Um, the one my, my lady's co-worker had picked up for me, I ended up giving it away to my brother-in-law. Um, the box had a little bit of damage, so that's the reason I really picked the other one up, or else I wouldn't have. But, um, he was happy with it, um, and, you know, I was able to give something away. <laughs> um, so, um, so that's that. That was, that's, that's that backstory to that, so that's how I missed out on all that. Sorry if I bored you guys. Um, but, um, also picked up this whole set right here. And as you guys may know, your guys' targets might be having like freaking sales in a lot of their older pops. And um, picked up this whole set right here. At Target, Doctor Strange. Sorry if you guys can't really see it that good, but I picked up the whole Doctor Strange, and I say the whole Doctor Strange because I have pretty much I have pretty much everyone else already, except for that Walmart exclusive. I don't have that one, so sorry, yeah, I don't have that one. But man, I paid like seven bucks for all these together. I was like, cool, sweet. So that was awesome picking that. Like no biggie because you're like super old. But I really been wanting to pick up for sure, uh, Cassilius and the Ancient One because after watching the movie, the Ancient One really became one of my favorite characters. And also, what else did I pick up? A uh, quick GameStop um, haul. Not a haul. It's only two items. <laughs> I need to get my hauls together. Um, I picked up uh, this guy. Super happy at six ninety seven from GameStop. And uh, I needed this guy right here, so um, I don't know what it was. At first, when I first seen him, I was like, "Oh, this guy's cool! Like, I gotta have it." But then, as it went, time went on. I was like, "Yeah, it don't seem so cool. Like, <laughs> it, it's not. It wasn't as a as 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 great as I thought it was when it first came out, you know." But um, definitely happy to pick him up at six ninety seven. Um, so definitely, uh, like, what can I say, you know? And <laughs> also picked up. And this guy, I told myself, um, you know, if I find him, I find him. If I don't, I don't. Um, but glad I did. And they had just put him out. Uh, picked up this guy right here. Oh, well, let me just... <laughs> R5-D4. And uh, I know this guy did not get a lot of camera time, but it's cool, though. Um, you know, like I told my, I told myself, if, if I find him, I find him. That's pretty much how I am right now with the rest of the Wave, uh, wave 2, because I haven't really had no luck with them. So when I find it, I find it. And if I don't, I don't. But... Um, I'll, I'll hopefully hunt those little by little like a time will eventually come for them to get hunted <laughs> Right, so I picked up these guys at GameStop on Thursday and the rest of the stuff so far has been on Wednesday um, What else what else? Oh also picked up uh, These guys right here I don't know if you guys sorry for the bad lighting if any but uh my buddy my uh, my buddy pedro picked these guys up for me he's all like he was on the road and he's all like hey man uh do you have these guys and he sent me a he sent me a picture of them and i was like oh no man like i haven't seen them at any walgreens that i've been to and so i was definitely happy to add these guys to the collection um that's the, the midas i think and uh radium batman i believe uh don't quote me on that <laughs> but um i think those are the ones they are but it's cool man because i have the i have the, the pop version so you know these are these definitely were a a plus to add to the collection for that reason and they look pretty bitching man this one has a beat up box if you guys can can see it right in the top in the front <laughs> and this one's pretty clean but definitely happy i'm not and i told myself i was gonna cut it out with the dorbs and yet here i am still buying dorbs shame on me <laughs> um all right, guys, what else do we have? And today, oh, not today, sorry. I um, did some some quick, I did a quick toy hunt on Thursday, on thir no, Friday morning before going, because I did go to work for a little bit. And after that, I came out, um, and I left work like around, I forgot what time, but it was early enough for me to stop by Walmart, Target, and Toys R Us. And I didn't find anything at Toys R Us. And in Walmart, I did score. Um, I picked up these guys right here. I picked up the Joker. And picked up Jim Gordon as Batman. So I hope you guys can see him. I know it's not the best, but hopefully at least a glimpse. And these, I was I was shocked. I was pretty shocked to find to have. They also uh, to to find these guys, but um, they also had the Flash. I think Jay Garrick, and then they had Hawkman. 
they didn't have Zoom, I think I would have picked up Zoom for sure, and ba or Batgirl. Um, I think those are the, the two that I really, really want to pick up. And the build a figure on this guy is King Shark, and he looks pretty badass. <laughs> he looks like if Street Sharks like had a, a, a like a evil brother or something, that would have been him. That guy looks pretty pretty badass. Matter of fact, it'd be nice to put some rollerblades on that guy. <laughs> Street Sharks, man. But yeah, I picked up these guys on, on Friday morning at Walmart in Burbank. And super happy, man. And 16 bucks. They rang up at 16 bucks. I thought I was going to have to give them the old uh, wrong peg, but they're all like, no, no, no. So they, they rang them up and $16. Sweet. So that is that. And then, like I said, I also stopped by Toys R Us, which I must say I was chatting it up with another fellow collector, um, Eric. And uh, me and Eric had met once already before. He, he recognized me just from my fanny pack and whatnot. <laughs> um, so, um, 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 what's it called? Yeah, we were there. We, we there was a, there was a line to get in. We're all like, oh, I was like, oh man, that's got to be a switch or nest, right? Get there and it was for a switch. Yeah, so there goes me and Eric waiting in line, chatting it up, man. Um, you know, just uh, sharing sharing stories, man. It was awesome. Um, Eric, if you're watching this, man, huge shout out yet again. You know, thank you. You know, you uh, that man is a is a he's a hardcore uh, collector and uh, he, um, he's not only a hardcore collector, a very 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 awesome, very kind guy. Um, Super awesome, you know. He follows. He follows. You we were talking how um, I had asked him see if he's gonna if he wanted to, if he was if he wants to if he was gonna go up to Frankincense on this this week in the twenty seventh is when the big hoorah, the hoopla is happening, <laughs> uh, which I'm definitely for sure gonna try to make. Like I'm super excited. Um, and um, he was just yeah. He said he met the Essos uh, collector uh, Essos uh, yeah the Oxnar the Oxnar fellas. Um, um, he had met him already and, and they were like just 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 talking over there man it's it's cool you know and, and it's it, like i said he follows d-bag he follows uh you know he follows a, a lot of other collectors man so um you know we do it for people like eric man to hopefully help them hunt and you know see you know we all we all help each other out man but awesome chatting it up with you buddy um but yeah we were out there and there I, we were honestly there for one reason and one reason only <laughs> boom picked up the two pack and 40 bucks is pretty steep, but I mean, shoot, if I paid 40 bucks for the Vulture and Spider-Man and basically got a same old Spider-Man, um, there's no way I was going to pass on this one because we all know he loves himself some Mary Jane. <laughs> Mary Jane, man. So I, I believe it's the first figure, her first uh, ever figure. I'm not sure. I think so. Um, but yeah, then we get a new Spidey. And we pretty much wiped them out. You know, they had one box. At least that's what, you know, we they showed us. Um, awesome people that toyed with us. Danny, you the man. Thank you. <laughs> um, there was four in a box. So just in case you're wondering, there's a four coming in a box. Because that was me, Eric. Eric grabbed one for his buddy. And another fellow collector, uh, Rick, was there. He grabbed one for himself, too. So it's awesome, man. So definitely happy to add this uh, this to the collection right here. Um, I seen everybody getting in the on the syndicate group. Like, I seen them getting... Um, um, picking her up, so I was like, oh man, like, it's, you know, that group is so badass, man, you guys, like, I'm sure everyone by now is part of it, especially anybody that watched Toy Hunting videos, that group is, is, is by far one of the best things I've, like, one of the best clubs I've ever been involved in, and, um, and, or part of, better yet, and it's just, it's just awesome, man, and you feel, definitely, you feel like you're part of a special club, like, uh, these guys are, you know, the, the head honchos, man, or, always there showing love to everybody man like they're always there commentating you know liking stuff and posting information um you know mikey martinez um he's always putting out you know good good information um you know cincy nerd man d-bag ejg12 um so many hunters you know like even like like hunters that are coming up you know or or like just starting it up man it's it it's just a big old family like it's a big old family and awesome to be part of um, but yeah, so that's there. <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to get, I don't mean to get sidetracked. You know, always it always happens. <laughs> uh, where am I at? All right, guys. So now I'm gonna open um, these two uh, these two boxes that I've been like itching. I haven't opened them um, just because I want to open them. You know, while I'm recording. So um, I'm definitely amped up. I'm excited. This is, these are you guys might know what one of them is, but the other one. I have not even mentioned that I ordered them online. <laughs> and I got them because of the syndicate group. I forgot I forgot the name of who posted it, but you know who you are if you're watching. Do the real MVP. <laughs> um, all right, guys. So what's your name? I'm going to open up the one I got from Brad Campbell. Campbell. And, uh, you know, this guy, he's, he's awesome, man. Super, super cool. You know, he, 
he reached out to help to help uh to help me out you know and we, I'm, I'm super happy that we were able to both help each other out you know i i picked him up a sunfire and um and you know i shot him i shot him over the sunfire and he sent me over the the this guy that's inside this box right here um so but this is all part of the syndicate group man that's what i've been telling you guys if you're not part of if you're not joined i mean if you if you haven't joined it it, it, it only benefits guys like it, it it's awesome Family shank here. Awesome packaging, by the way, buddy. <laughs> Get over there. Woo. Look at this guy. He picked up the Punisher for me. And I know some of you guys are probably wondering, like, uh, dude, bro, like, I, I have, like, there's, like, ten of them at my Walgreens. You know what, man? Before I got into collecting this, uh, Marvel Legends, I've always, I, I'm, like, mostly collect pops when I first started collecting. Well, first it was bobbleheads, like, Dodger bobbleheads, and then it, it, it just slowly came into pops. And um, I was hardcore into pops. I, every time I go to Walgreens, when they'd get an exclusive... I'd always go over there and and always see him I, when he when he came out. I would always see him and I'd be like, ah, I want to pick him up because he was just. I always been a fan of figures. Like I used to play with, um, with you know X Men toys and GI Joe when I was a kid. Um, so I always kept my eye on these, um, but I just never pulled the trigger just because I was like, nah, I'd rather save my money for the pop, for the pop, for the pop. And I was like, I was a pop addict. <laughs> I'm still am a little bit, but now I I'm, I'm learned to to cool off a little bit. But uh, he picked up the Punisher for me, man. So Brad Will, uh, Brad Williams. No, no, no. Hold up, I'm ch I'm messing up your name. So, Donaldson, right? Uh, sorry about that. That's how horrible I am with names. Oh, not even close, man. Sorry. Brad Campbell. <laughs> thank you, Brad Campbell, man. You are, you know, thank you so much, man. Um, if you ever need anything, you just let me know, man. Like I said, I'm always I'm I'm always about helping. You know, see if I can. I'm always about seeing if I can help people, you know, other collectors. Um, I wish I can help everybody. I wish I had the biggest bank account and I can just help everybody and send these things out for free. But I, that's not how it works. <laughs> At least not quite yet, right, guys? Um, but, um, yeah, so he picked up. Thank you, Brad Campbell, for picking up the Punisher for me. I can add this guy to the collection. Boom, punny. Killer pun. <laughs> um, yeah, super happy, man. Um, and then, doo -doo -doo -doo, doo -doo 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 -doo. Doo -doo I don't know why I'm humming that song. I don't even know what song it is I'm humming. <laughs> um, this one's from Amazon. And one thing when you're cutting, guys, never cut towards you. Cut away from you. <laughs> As uh, I only say that because uh, here I am cutting my way towards me. Family shank away. Put this guy down. And here is item numero uno. What pam? <laughs> uh, this is a this is Spider Man right here. He's from a different. Um, you know what? To be honest, like I'm not even gonna say too much on this one because I don't. I know. I don't know if it's from a different, uh, a different Earth or a different universe. Minutes Spider Man battle side of the universal justice yeah you see I, i'm not even gonna sit here and bs you guys i don't really know much about this guy but i know that that he came up he was available on uh on amazon and i was so badly like impatiently like wanting some of this these figs so i was just like i'll pull the trigger and i didn't get what happened beth i'll be back oh, i'm gonna go with you well he's already there okay so i'll be back um I picked this guy up um, because you know this was this I don't know maybe I'll use it to trade or something. Um, not sure yet, but um, I was definitely happy. I mean, you never know. Actually, I might collect the whole the ones I really want. Um, well, let me show you guys what I got first. What the hell, you know, <laughs> I'm over here yapping away. Um, yeah, so definitely happy. Um, 50 50. Like originally, to, to be honest, guys, I wasn't even planning on picking this guy up. But um, once he became available on Amazon, I was so excited that, you know, some homecoming way was maybe coming my way. <laughs> so I, I definitely pulled the trigger on him. And also, picked up Spider-Man with this uh, homemade suit. And this one for sure I, I was planning on getting. 
like this one for sure. I was like one of those where it's like it, it needs it needs to get picked up. Like I'm a, I'm one of those I'm a Spider Man fan, and you know it's just some characters I feel like ah I gotta grab them. <laughs> but yeah, this box came in better condition than this one, but they're both pretty pretty legit clean, so I'm not gonna complain. And now that I have shown you both that I got the one I really the ones I really 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 want is uh, the Moon Knight. It's Tombstone and it's uh, Mar the Vulture they got. And I don't know why, but that Vulture just looks pretty damn sick. Like, the outfit looks, like, amazing. Um, they pulled it off right, you know? Like, they, they definitely pulled it off right. Because, you know, when you first heard the Vulture, like, what are they going to do? Put the green spandex on him? <laughs> like, and, and let, him, let him roll like that? You know, we knew that wasn't going to happen. But um, that'd be awesome if they kind of throw, like, a little, uh, like, a little, um, you know, throw some love that way, you know, just so that. You know, it, it's it'd definitely be funny to see that on the big screen. Um, but yeah, definitely happy you picked up these two guys. And I'll, like I said, I was excited to open them up. And um, I got one more coming my way, but you guys will probably see that on some some other time. Because <laughs> I don't even know how long I've been yapping for. But yeah, guys, so this, this is my haul. And like I said, hopefully you guys... Um, hopefully you guys enjoy the, the Vegas hunt. Um, it, it was fun hunting. It was a... Uh, so, you know, it's always fun when you hunt, you know, outside the city, really. Um, you know, you get used to the same stuff over and over again. And, and hopefully um, you guys enjoyed it a little bit, you know. I mean, um, I was really trying to, like, balance both, you know, hunting and, and just kind of not worry about hunting. Because <laughs> we know this isn't a job, but sometimes it sure. It doesn't feel like it, but it's just, like, sometimes we just put that, like, we want, we want, we want. Like, we got to go get it, um, you know, so... Yeah, so it was like, I think I did all right. I wanted, like I said, I wanted to show you guys more of the lifestyle over there. But to be honest, like I said, I really don't do that kind of stuff anymore. You know, now I'm just, I'm, I'm happy just to, to wine and dine and, and go hunting and, and play, play some, uh, play, play some blackjack or the slot machines. <laughs> I'm old man at heart, man. Uh, old man at heart. Um, but quick side story too. Like, um, I remember uh, talking about how I, I missed out on this guy, you know, back in the day. One of the biggest ones I've ever passed on. And true story, like this one still to this day haunts me, but it, it haunts me, but it's like whatever it is, what it is. <laughs> um, Pizza Spidey, I seen him at Walgreens, and at the time Walgreens was having like a, the like the had the had the figs at like fourteen ninety nine because they were they were on sale, and um, I was like so close to picking them up just because the fig looked so damn dope. I was like, man, I gotta I gotta get I gotta get this guy. I had him in my hand, was about to pay, and I was like, ah, you know what? No, I'd rather get a pop, and put him down. So to this day, just a little side, a little, a little side story. To this day, that one still bites me in the butt, but I'm okay without it. So you see, guys, it, it, it sometimes you, you, we let's not forget never to act like this is the end of the world. We don't find these guys because it's not. Um, somehow, some way, we want them. They'll come our way. Um, we just can't like make this like priority. <laughs> All right, guys. So that, that's for myself too. Like I say that because I'm really just talking. To myself and hopefully you know it, it spreads out to you guys so that we know that there's a lot worse things happening in the world that this to somebody could be a meal it could be you know a some kind of bill some kind of payment towards something and we have a, we have we you know we, we we work i'm sure a lot of us work our butt off and to, to make this happen which i know i do for sure um but let's just remember that they're just they're just figs all right guys um and that for sure is it <laughs> i don't have anything else I don't think I have anything else to show you guys. Um, yeah, so I, I guess you guys will see what I pick up towards uh, in the next video. So I'll make this one and um, and then put out the hunt, work on the hunt one. All right, guys. So I'm definitely trying to get all this stuff out before um, Saturday because I'm definitely excited to go to Frank and Sons. And, you know, I'm going to strap the GoPro camera on myself because... I don't know how much of this I'm going to be doing. Like, I just kind of want to enjoy the moment. <laughs> so, um, I can't even promise a, a hunt, but I definitely try to do something and, you know, just so that I'm, I'm enjoying it, but yet still maybe capturing some of the moments, meeting, meeting some of these awesome fellow collectors, man. So, um, I can't wait, but like always, thank you guys for watching. I definitely appreciate it. And to my winner, um, I haven't shipped out your prize yet, but it will be shipped out before this week is over. I, I promise. All right? I'm, I've been lagging it. Um, I've been, like, just... I've been lagging it. There's no oh, no excuse, all right? So I do apologize for that, but it will be sent out ASAP, all right? I haven't forgotten. I promise. Um, all right, guys? So remember, stay humble. Always appreciative. Always grateful. And, you know, let's be happy with things that come our way. Um, you know, it's it's the right message to spread, and hopefully, you know, this hopefully it makes a difference to somebody or someone. But I know there's a lot of awesome people out there, 
and that's why I try to preach it sometimes. And like I say, I preach it because I need to hear it myself as well. Trust me, we're all humans. <laughs> um, all right, guys. So you know, much peace and love. Um, and you know, think positive out there. Let's so let's, let's make sure we we help each other and not are out you know out here out, out here to to hurt anyone or to to put anyone down. All right, guys. So. Uh, to all my fellow hunters, collectors out there, thank you guys so much. Hopefully you guys have an awesome night. Hopefully you guys are finding everything you guys are looking for. Um, and, you know, happy hunting, man. And um, it's, it's, it's fun. Let me just say that, guys. It's fun and definitely happy that I am able to do this. So thank you guys so much. Peace.